Tatkukker, Call of Duty Fucking T30 Vi går med Call of Duty Hvorfor den markerede? What the fuck? Fucking radio, turn off the radio. Thank you. <laughs> <gasps> oh, the radio was really irritating and listen on. Ah, then I go through the wrong fucking lane again. Guy, they're lagging. Why are lagging so much? Right now. Need to talk to Punch and Judy. She in her den? 
Yep. Take the stairs down. I'll let Judy know you're coming. Whoa, whoa, start again. What is it you want us to do now? Beat some sense into Oh my god, what lagging? Oh my god. Ah, maybe that in that one. Uh, in that one. Oh, it expand. <coughs> uh, in task. Uh, also use a lot of memory on wham. Turn that off. Turn that off. Turn that off. Turn that off. That help, but I think that help. <coughs> Watch it. <laughs> Jude is embarrassing herself again. Hey, where are you going? Nothing to see back Let here. Let it lie. Judy's friend. You done with Abagulio? Yep. Back to the bottom. Stop telling every joy toy you meet to come here. The hell I'm supposed to do with them all? You so concerned about strays? Go take care of your guest. Suze, we're not done here. Oh yeah, we fucking are. You just don't give up, do you? Got nothing more to say to each other. Mox's nomads don't seem so different. Both seem to yammer a lot about community. Solidarity. I get it all over and fail. What comes first? Family or the outside this is world? A club. Nobody cares about your lofty world views. Oh, shadow. Back. Everyone mm -hmm. in this city lives in their own goddamn bubble. I'm dead. And either you fly high. Night tanks and spot tanks. The hobby in E7 and Patch at Tolotons. Susie seems to know what she's doing. E7 and that's a little so. So then I was. This is a little bit of a little bit of a little bit I need to talk to her. It's important. Why? So you can make her your scapegoat for your train wreck of a heist. Seem to know how the heist went. Meaning you did talk to her. I know how you fucked up. Got all your doom left killed like a real pro. Caught some lead myself too. Boo hoo! Occupational hazard for you, Mercs. Sure, I took a risk. We all did. But it was Evelyn who gave it to us in the first place. She knew what this was from the start. Again, the dragon. Fine. Looks like we're all in this piss pot together. But you're desperate. Writing's on your face. Okay, let's just say I'm pretty much fucked. Biochip and Klepp during the heist is killing me. Albeit slowly. Evie commissioned the job. I know how to stop that. That's why I need to know who hired her. Huh. All right, some all let's article, say but I, I believe you. All right. Evelyn's a doll. Used to work at Clouds. I'd look for her there. Where is that? Sig case on my table's got the address. Oh, Take it, and once you find Evelyn, give it to her. Mega Tower. Luxurious. Wait. Um... Just let me know how she's doing. Okay. I'll give you a call, okay? Thanks. Thank you, V.
A doll. Why am I not surprised? You're an engram in a fading mind. Nothing should surprise you anymore. So we're gonna hit this place, Clouds? Why the hell not? brings in a lot of biz. Pisses at share a cost, too. Nah, I'm just admiring your operation. We took over this place way back when. Every day I wake up and wonder how it's still standing. We get by, that's all I'll say. Where do you give the working girls a helping hand? That's ancient history. And like all history, it was pretty damn bloody. What was it? Something about a riot. Joy girl murdered by a tiger claw? Not the first. Just the one that tipped the scales. Folk went ballistic. Yeah, some um, as a young medium, you flew a step from heaven, Scorpion, and Tini. The whole freak show. It's how the mocks got started. But that's all. Forget Evelyn. Admit it. This is about Judy's virtues, isn't it? Good shit, if I say so myself. They call me Mr. Hands. If you're looking for Pacifica jobs, call me. Name's V. And what? No, pleased to meet you? Hm. I'm truly honored to meet you. You got any biz? Call me. Liquid die until the day you die. And I Bye. twice more Go stuff on. than usual. I said the legal lead. What for legal display leave Lucy man? Hmm. 
Og jeg bruger 73% af min ram. Cyberpunk bruger 4 GB. Facebook, uh, Firefox bruger halvanden. Det er 6 GB. Så er 6 GB tilbage. Og oh, hvad bruger resten? Hvad bruger resten? Hmm. OBS bruger 500, Discord på 200. Hmm. Jeg skal have flere ramme uden computer, det bliver nødt til. You're bringing me down, Chum. The way I see it, the only thing waiting for you here is getting off or getting off. Place your bets. If I miss this time, enlighten me. Brain dance chick is hiding something. No coincidence we already saw two tiger claws. They must control the building. I think Judy's lying. Why? Little something called intuition. Ever heard of it? Oh, so what you meant to say was you're full of shit. Got it. I don't really think she's lying. I just think she doesn't. She don't know. So hold up. Some mummies. what you're looking for. Would you care to jack into the terminal? All right, let's do this. This will be a live session, so events may take an unexpected turn. But don't quit if you feel uncomfortable. You could miss out on something truly remarkable. If you feel unready to handle what comes next, you can interrupt the session immediately. Now for your safe word. Afterlife. And saved. Now, bear with me a moment. Scanning your personal profile. You should see compatible dolls in just a second. Interesting. Is that normal or...? Who can say what is normal? You're clearly a unique person with... unique tastes. Our system can handle it. So who will it be? Angel or Sky? I'd rather go with Sky. I couldn't have chosen better myself. Now for the payment, and you'll venture into the clouds. There you go. And the payments come through. The entire floor is open to you if you wish to wind down first. Sky awaits you in booth nine. Disconnect, <clears throat> please. Is that it? <clears throat> we have a strict no weapons policy here at Clouds. Please deposit any and all hazardous items with me. Only two willing okay, to spread their that was an F -meter for Zemo. Sad. Go eat a dick, Johnny. Clouds is... Thank you. We hope you enjoy your stay. Guess that makes you a real deviant. Would have had more choices if I didn't have a certain brain parasite. I'm Sky. 
And you must be Vincent? Welp, looks like this will be interesting. So, V, you're dying. How'd you know I'm dying? Deep inside. You fear this. Cower before it. So what if I do? Why do you care? Of all the voices in your head, the loudest is that calling for help. Look around. All of this is your doing. Looking for someone named Evelyn Parker. Used to work here. Know her? Know where she is? You need answers. That's clear. Just not the ones you think you need. I asked you a simple question. Evelyn Parker. Not the most important thing you're looking for, is she? Oh, very Casper. I can smell your fear. Keep out of there. Huh? Like my. You're yeah, afraid of something else. No, Casper. This could not. This could not go no more. I'm going to see that after one last Okay. <laughs> Tell me what I'm so afraid of. It's something you don't talk about. Everybody is entitled to secrets. Ah, yeah, I heard something from the boy. Say it for two times. Say it out loud. <laughs> Not for me, but for yourself. I snuffed it once, and I'm gonna do it all over again. Got no idea how to stop it. There, Abby. You're scared. Because you've given up on your dreams. What happened to becoming the best in all of Night City? Still want to be the best. Never gave up on that goal. Chances of getting there are starting to look pretty slim, though. I just want the world to know that I was here. That I mattered. Instead of a dream, you're living a nightmare. You're afraid of being erased. As if you never existed. Or is it just the fear of becoming someone else? Different? Death is death is death. You're gone, game over. You can't know that for certain. Even if you've been there and back. Believe me. I've seen it. And it's fucking boring. You haven't stopped grieving since. Or for what's to come. What's past is past. I'm over it. You're in denial. Don't you see? Would it change things even by a hair if I wasn't? So what now? Is you're gonna tell me? You've never backed down from anything in your life, even when you maybe, maybe should have. You go through Night City knowing a stray bullet could end you while hailing a cab, but that's never stopped you from taking action, going where you needed, needed to, to go, go. And, and it won't, won't stop you now. Stop you. Now. But how do I keep up with everything that's changing? You have been keeping up. You've made an impact. Not a single that thing in really this came world in. isn't in the process of becoming, becoming something, something else. Like my Likewise, shoes. you never look back. back. If you okay. got a kill. If you gotta burn it all to the ground. Thanks, so uh, for all this. Jeez. Don't even feel like getting up. Few do. But everything has its own. Oh, Afterlife. <coughs> oh, what's going on? Goddamn thing threw me out. 
need to talk to you. Talk? You pulled the emergency brake, ripped me out just to talk? What happened? I do something wrong? Evelyn Parker, what do you know about her? Not much. Everyone's got their own booths, their own problems, their own little bubbles. It's a fragile ecosystem. People like you barge in, violate it, try to rearrange. No. I need this info. Name your price. Fuck you, your Eddies and that girl of yours. I could get fired for doing something like this. I'll make it worth your while. All right, fine. Hand it over and get out before you land me in the shit. Anything out of the ordinary happened here lately? Fine. Heard a customer did a number on her. But that's all I know. Shit like that happens around here way more often than anybody care to admit. You ought to ask Tom. Two of them were inseparable, gossiping for hours on end. Who's Tom? A dog, like the rest of us. What do you think? An XBD star? Where will I find him? Here we go. VIP area. Booth 2, I think. Thanks. See? You turn out to be useful after all. Not bad. I can't get in? What's that mean? I'm here every motherfucking week! Fuck! So pissed myself. You're not in trouble. Just want to talk for a little. Where's Evelyn? Need to talk to her urgently. It's important. Hey, well, I, are you mad at her? Or not? No. Know where she is or not. Uh, she's not here. Tried calling her more than once. No answer. I heard she was chipping a new faceplate in a clinic in Osaka. No, no. Oslo. That was it. Evelyn tell you personally she was going away? Um, no. Just didn't show up for work. Wasn't picking up either, so I asked Woodman what was up. Told me she left, like I said. Woodman, who is he? Mr. Forrest, but we all call him Woodman. Never really known why. Okay, Mr. Forrest then. Who is he? Um, he's kind of like our caretaker. Finds new talent, deals with ugly situations. Could it be Woodman finally shed some light on this shit show? Man can only dream. The skull sponges in these dolls. Ugh. That's what they should be replacing. Chill. Keep calm. I'm looking for a girl. Okay, Cap. Interesting word choice for someone who plowed through massacre uh, all along the way. Let's get this over with. Things got out of hand, I'll admit. But cooperate, and no one else will get hurt. 
I don't negotiate with terrorists. You're the king of fuck-ups. You're not helping. Now what? Hell, why don't you just scan the truth from his gray, lifeless eyes? Or scour his cop? That just might work. Sold her off to a ripper. Ship was busted. Could have sent her to get it patched up. A ripper named Fingers in a back alley for hookers. Sounds like a Joy Toy's wet dream. Why don't you return your weapons? No, I'd rather not. <laughs> 